Hey, shalom, Israel. First and foremost, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh. Mahashem. Yahweh Shah. Waha. Rakah Kodash. Barakatham. I'm on to the apostles and elders, the great millstone that do rule well. Peace and blessings to you, brothers out there that are kicking his word to sincerity and truth. I'm the brother Kalab from the GMS Dallas camp, and I have with me the brother. Thank you. Which is what I want to go into. We, yeah, we, we went in, you know, sent, up, sent each other a few verses, and we want to go into something about, you know, I don't want to, we didn't want to get brothers caught up in, in trees, you know, watching views, man, to see how many people are in that video, man. Like, whether it's, it's viewed one time or 100 or 1,000, man, you know, you got to keep pushing the word of Yahweh by Shemiah This is This is to glorify him, man. This is not for ourselves, man. We can't be looking for, uh, we know anybody watching my videos, man. This is not about, you know, you know, somebody watching your videos, man. It could be one person that watch your video and, and it could be, and they convert, it, it can't convert them into the truth, man. You know, it could be one view, that one view, and the way you broke down or that breakdown or, or, or that verse or whatever, it can help them, you know what I'm saying, come into the fold, man, you know? It's not always about how many people have viewed your video, man. You know? So, without further ado, Young Club, could you, uh, you know, read, read, read Ezekiel for me? 37 starting at the top. Gone. This is Ezekiel 37, verse 1. The hand of the Lord, uh, the hand of the Lord was upon me, and carried me out in the spirit of the Lord, and set me down in the midst of the valley which was full of bones. Mm -hmm. And it caused me to pass by them round about, and behold, there were very many in the open valley, and lo, they were very dry. Come on, see the Lord put the spirit on to go into the valley, man. You know, and and, and he says six bones, man. And he said, Lo, they were very dry. And it was many. You know? There's a lot of bones, man. Continue to read, brother. Come on, verse 3. And he said unto me, Son of man, can these bones live? And mm -hmm. I and I answered, O Lord power, thou knowest. Again, uh -huh. he, again he said unto me, Prophesy upon these bones, and say unto them, O ye dry bones, Hear the word of the Lord. God, and, and, and that's what we're doing, man. We're prophesying to, to, to dry bones, man. Like you said, can these bones live? He said, Lord, you know what I'm saying? You know. You know, but he didn't. So the Lord was, he gave him the spirit to do so, man. Like you said, we, we don't, like, we're not prophesying to people that, that already know. <laughs> no, we're, we're preaching for people that don't. You know, those dry bones in the valley, man. We're preaching to wake those dry bones up. We're preaching to give those dry bones life, man. You know, we're not looking for somebody else to be like, hey, you broke that down right there. If, if a brother watched your video and it's a great video, then that's cool, man. You know, we watch, we always watch each other's videos, man, but don't always get caught up in, in watching views. You know, seeing who's watching your video. It doesn't, it doesn't matter, man. You're, 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 you're prophesying to glorify Yahweh by Shem Yahweh man. This is not about us. It's about waking up the whole from the leg. Alright, uh, brother, continue. Uh, Unless you got something to say? No, no. Uh, I'm just trying to find my place. Uh, verse 5. Well, I'm going to start back at verse 4. Again, he said unto me, Prophesy upon these bones, and say unto them, O ye dry bones, hear the word of the Lord. Thus saith the Lord power unto these bones, Behold, I will cause breath to enter into you, and ye shall live. Uh, and that's, what, that's, that, that's what we're doing, like by preaching the word of God, by Shema man. You know what I'm saying? We're, we're causing that, that, that breath, that, that, that spirit, that spirit of truth to enter unto them, and the bones shall, shall live, you know? Come on, man, because uh, what is that breath? You know what I'm saying? That breath is that this uh, wisdom, uh, knowledge, and understanding, you know? Let me see. I'm trying to find a precept real quick just to uh, pretty much... Here, let me, I think I... Uh... Well, once I find it, I'll, uh, I'll bring it up. Okay, uh, 
This is back in verse 5, right? Thus saith the Lord power unto these bones. Behold, I will cause breath to enter into you, and ye shall live. And I will lay sinews upon you, and will bring up flesh upon you, and cover you with skin, and put breath in you, and ye shall live, and ye shall know that I am the Lord. And, and like, like I said, that's what we're doing, man. If, if, if we, if we are abide in this truth and, and, and speak the truth, like the Lord will put that breath upon, upon those dry bones, man. Like, this is not about you just, like I said, speaking to people that already know. Like I said, brothers, why, why don't you tell the videos? Of course, man, but, like, <clears throat> our mission is to wake up the hope from the light, man. To wake up those dry bones, man. That's, that's the mission that we have, to glorify Yah by Shemi Hoshan. When we do so, that, that causes, like I said, that causes that, 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 that breath to be, to be put in those dry bones. And we don't know that, that and those dry bones are going to know that that's it, Yah by Shemi Hoshan, man. Come on, come on. All right, I found it, I found it. Here, I'm going to bring this out real quick. This is uh, Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 7. Yeah, chapter 7, I'm going to start at verse 24. For wisdom is more moving than any motion. She passeth, she passeth and goeth through all things by reason of her pureness. For she is the breath of the power of Yahweh, and a pure influence of flowing from the glory of the Almighty. Therefore can no un, un, undefiled thing fall into her, man. Hey, like it said right there, for, you know, talking about wisdom, for she is the breath of the power of your hell, man. You know, so that when it's, you know, when it's going into a, a prophesying to these dry bones, you know, like we read in verse, uh, uh, verse five, thus saith the Lord power unto these bones. Behold, I will cause breath to enter into you and you shall live. You know, is that is that wisdom, man? That 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 understanding that's going to enter into them. That's right. And like like you read in verse six, man, it's just forming that 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 tissue. You know what I'm saying? That flesh, that skin, and it's formed that. that verse six is talking about a, a a body. You know what I'm saying? A a body being you know revived. You know, like because of because of that 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 wisdom, that knowledge, and understanding, man. God, yeah, yeah, the Most High, uh, hey, put in that spirit, you know, because if you, uh, uh, if you go to, to uh, what is that, John 6 and 63, you know, mm -hmm. the words that I speak unto you, you know, they are spirit and they are life. That's right, Akia. You know what I'm saying? What does that mean? Uh, uh, what is that word? Uh, the words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. Uh, I believe it's the word spirit. I believe it's the word spirit. I think in the heat in the in the Greek it means to you know to animate, you know to bring to life. Yeah, to bring to life, yeah. Khan, you know, uh, you want me to keep going on that? Khan, verse it. So I prophesied as I was commanded, and as I prophesied there was a noise, and behold a shaking, and the bones came together, bone to his bone. Man, you see, that's how the spirit works, man. You know. Like when, when, and, and like I said, there was a noise and, 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 and a shaking of the bone. So like the bones came together, bone to the side. Sorry, brother, continue. God. Verse 8. And then, and when I beheld, and when I beheld, lo, the sinews and the flesh came upon them, and the skin covered them above, but there was no breath in them. Yeah. Verse 10. So I prophesied as he commanded me, and the breath came into them, and they lived, and stood up upon their feet, an exceeding great army, man. Hey, hey, that goes, that breath, that wisdom and understanding came into them, so they were brought to life, you know? Verse, Could you read on verse 9 for me again? Okay, Khan. Verse 9, then said he unto me, prophesy unto me, or select it. Then he said unto me, prophesy unto the wind, prophesy... Khan. Yeah, that's what we're supposed to do, man. Prophets down to the wind, man. It's not, it's not about, you know, like, somebody always hearing what you got to say, man. Sometimes, like, you, you won't get no views on a video, you know? But you, you did that because, because of what? Because you know that, but the most I say, he'll give you the words to speak. And 
you spoke those words, man, and, and Lord willing, you know what I'm saying, it was edified, and it can, it can possibly wake up somebody, man. It's not about you. Like I said, it's not about you always somebody, hey, you know, I did this video, you know, this. And like I said, brothers do check out each other's videos sometimes. We send each other videos, but sometimes, man, man it's, 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 it's hundreds and hundreds of videos going up daily, man. You know, sometimes a brother might not run across your video, man. That doesn't mean you're supposed to stop doing videos. Okay, yeah. con, con, uh, Salakia. I just want to read that verse, and uh, I just want to go back to uh, John six and sixty-three. Okay. You know, um, I'm gonna read it real quick. It, it is the spirit that quickeneth; the flesh profiteth nothing. The words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. Now, the word quickeneth is the word uh, that I was talking about, not spirit. You know, and, and in the Greek, uh, it is zopeo right and it means to produce alive to get or bear living young to cause to live make alive give life you know what i'm saying by spiritual power to arouse and invigorate to restore to life to give increase of life does a physical life of the spirit quickening as respects as respects the spirit endued with the new and greatest uh, and greater powers of life you know what i'm saying so hey man it's the spirit that that, that quickeneth you know what i'm saying it's the spirit that brings to life you know what i'm saying that's right that's right Aki, yeah but uh yeah yeah that was it on that uh did you you want me to keep going on that ezekiel yeah just so uh, you can finish on uh, verse nine Okay, then said he unto me, prophesy unto the wind, prophesy son of man, and say to the wind, thus saith the Lord power, come from the four winds, O breath, and, and breathe upon the slain, that they may live. Come, man, that's what we're supposed to do, man. We're supposed to, 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 to speak to the four corners, man, the, the, the four winds, you know, and, 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 and Lord willing, it raise up the old from the legs. Like this, like I said, it's not about looking for a pat on the back every lesson you do, man. Looking for somebody to come in and say, you did a good job, man. Prophesy to the wind, man. You know? You're not doing this for, for you're doing this for your sake, but not, not your sake alone, man. You know? Mm -hmm. Glorify Yahweh by Shimmy Yahweh Shah first and foremost, and to wake up, you hopefully that. You know? Could you get that um, in uh, Ecclesiastes for me? Come on, this is Sirach. Uh, 37, or, uh, Salakia, 33, uh, 17. 17, okay, Syriac 33 and 30, 17, consider, consider that I labored not for myself only, but for all them that seek learning. God, and that's what that's right, when those drop bones wake up, man, they start to seek learning. You know, so you, you you're not doing this is not your turn to look for a pet on the back. Now you 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 have become a teacher, man. So you're doing these videos in in, in, in hopes to wake up the elect. This is not about you. Then go and find out about Shimmy as I said, man. It's not about a pat on the back. You know what I'm saying? This is not about watching views, man. It's it's not about you know what I'm saying, doing this for your sake to impress to impress other brothers with some research that you've done, man. You know. Do it for your sake and your sake only, man. I mean, well, not your sake, but, you know what I'm saying, do it for your, yourself first. But, you know, this is for, to, to wake up the hill for the living, you know, to glorify Yahweh by Shemiah You know? Come on. Uh, you want me to keep going on that? Nah, that's all I had on that one. Unless you got a precept. Uh, no, I don't. Uh, well, with that being said, man, Lord, what is this lesson? Is that a fine, man? And I want to say, call her law, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. That went us to the apostles there. It was a great millstone that do real well. A blessing to the elect. Shalom. Shalom.